the free rig. The free rig in Korea is extremely popular. Pretty much everybody that's fishing in Korea for bass is fishing with a, a free rig. Free rig is essentially just a Texas rig. Instead of having a bullet wedge, you just have a like a teardrop shaped sinker. So I'll explain this as, I, as I'm rigging it up. Got some 12 pound fluorocarbon line. That's pretty much the standard for what I use. A lot of people could use 10 pound, up to 16 pound, I guess. But usually I'm using between 10 and 12 pound fluorocarbon. So you take your sinker, run your line through the eye of the sinker. Now it's just running freely. Take whichever hook that you like to use. In this case, I'm using the EWG. You can use an offset, tie in a regular clinch nut, make a, put the one line through one time, make a loop with your fingers, run the tag in six times. Three, four, five, six, and run that back through the original loop and pull tight. Moisten it, pull tight. Trim off the tag. Now we have the sinker that just runs free, hence the name free rig. Take your favourite bait. Most of the time I'm fishing with some kind of hog, a brush hog, or in this case this is a waterman a bug hunter. It's in like a motor oil colour. Rig it normally. A quarter of an inch through, a little bit more in this case. I like to cover the knot as well. Find the point where you go through. So it's nice and straight. Then it just takes pause the hook point so it's weedless. Now as you're fishing this, as you cast it out and you're dragging it along the bottom, the weight moves so this is moving more freely as you're dragging it along the bottom, it's always, you know, it's moving much more freely compared to a Texas rig. And that's it, a free rig. Very, very popular in Korea right now and it catches a lot of fish. Fish on. Don't jump. I need to jump anyway. Little guy. Little guy. Got him on. A waterman. Bug hunter. Great little worm. Free rigged. So got the sinker just free rigged. And my Dobbins Champion 742 casting rod, 12 pound line. So we can get another one. There's one. Another little small guy. A bit better than the last one. A little bit better than the last one. No bloody tails yet. Hook just came out. No bloody tail, but he's a little male. There's a bite, there's a bite. He's left go of it. He's back on it again. 
He's not on it right now, but he's, he's hanging around it. Go on, some bite. Just a little guy. It feels a bit better. Oh, is it? Yeah, he's not. It's just another little one. Just another little one. It must be all stacked up down there again. He's only small, but I'll take him. He must have bit at that about four or five times before I, before I set the hook on him. on it. I feel a bit better. Maybe it's not. It felt solid at the bottom. Set the hook. Sounds like it felt like a solid fish. He'll do. This is the bait I'm using. Colour 193, a bug hunter from Waterman. There's a bike right there. Stay out. He's not very big. He's not big at all, but he's a fish and he's very welcome. Barely hooked, little tiny fella. Oh, look at this. Look at that. That's my hook. And look inside there. He's got another one in. Let's see if we can help him out. still eat even when it's got a hook stuck around its gullet
Come here, son. We haven't got many on this today. Get the one for this spot. 